Hey, Bert. Of course, I forgot my uh, uh, GoPro stick at the hotel. Uh, today's like the 29th, I think. And uh, I just went into town, Newport. See the bridge right there? That's the bridge that goes to Idaho. Idaho. And on the other side there is Newport. And so I'm down at the river. I just thought I'd stop and take a look. Something jumped right there. Something big jumped right there. Let's go see if we can see it. The water's fairly shallow. Maybe it'll go by. This place is nice. I really like this place. But look at that view. And this is maybe seven miles. It's probably seven miles away from uh, our house. Geese. There's something right there. People got their little docks and stuff down here. In the summer they put their docks up. There's an island in the middle of the thing. Well, I made it to the county buildings today, and everything got taken care of, boy. Everybody loves fucking Tom around here. Tom Johnson, throw his name out there, and fuck, uh, next thing you're sitting in the engineer's office talking about his fucking fishing trips and shit like that. Tom's man. Everybody likes Tom. I asked the first guy, I said, should I not fucking be throwing away around that guy's name? And they said, oh, no, you couldn't have met a better guy. So, my luck is fucking continues to keep going. Aside from my blisters and shit. <laughs> but I could see down in the water quite a bit. I know you're not going to be able to see on the camera. Because uh, I can't get it high enough up to get rid of the glare. But, so I went in first thing and went to the city hall... They sent me over, well, I did the uh, address there. And, of course, they're like, well, you got to do this and you got to do that. And I said, well, Tom already told me that they're like, Tom who? I said, Tom Johnson. They're, oh, shit, okay. Well, if we need anything, we'll just give him a call. I'm like, fucking A, man. That's awesome. And so uh, um, I filled out the paperwork for the address. They're just going to send, they're going to go out and look at it. And they're just going to send me a uh, confirmation of the address. And then we'll have an address. Once I get an address, I can get a license. But, of course, they're going to send that to me later. So I can't do the license stuff right now. So I basically don't have much to do the rest of the day. So I thought I'd go up to the property and just take the last look before I uh, maybe do some videos. This sucks, though, not having my fucking selfie stick. Um... They said uh, they had uh, they had some prey animals down here too. I think he said cougars and and uh, coyotes or something like that. They were all telling me. I'm telling you, these guys are excited about the fact that we bought a an elk farm, which is exactly what we did. We literally bought an elk farm. I talked to Tom's wife and and uh, she said that. You know, people are super helpful here. Don't get me wrong. I mean, fuck, I met like three people standing for five minutes in the post office. Everybody just wants to be nice and say hi and see what the fuck, you know, what the fuck you're all about. And, and maybe it matches up with what all they're all about, you know. So, yeah, just, wow, what a difference in states. But meeting Tom and Tracy and everybody, everybody knows them. So everybody at the county buildings and everything were like, oh, yeah, he, Tracy such and such. And I'm like, yeah, that's his name. And they're like, oh, yeah, he's one of my best friends. And then Tom, he knows everybody because he's the county road maintenance guy. So everybody wants to be friends with Tom. So what a great meet on that one. And on top of that, too, 
is it's a known fact that you know if you go and harvest an animal on someone's property they get a big portion of it all prepped up and ready to go so we might not even have to hunt we just give people authorization to come over and hunt for us and then they got to kill everything and bag it up box it up wrap it up and give it to us so that being north that being directly south you know and then east and west you would think this fucking river would be flowing south i mean all the rivers flow south out of the mountains not this one this one's fucking flowing that way and then it goes up almost into canada turns back around and comes down the next valley over it's pretty fucking amazing man i love this i love this river already and i talked to uh, rick rick is the engineer and the inspector for uh, the building permits and, and engineering uh, permits. And he's like my best friend too. We sat in his fucking office for, you know, almost an hour. Talking about his fishing and hunting and loving every day. That kind of shit. So, fucking shit is amazing. I love this shit. I really am not looking forward to going home. I mean, except I miss my wifey very much. And my doggies. I don't know who I miss the most, though. I really miss my dogs. <laughs> just kidding, Bert. All right, so I just thought I'd make a cool beach property and get out of the truck for a minute and get my mind right. You know what that means. Not everybody knows what that means. So, this is it, man. This is our world, right here. Look at that, it's just amazing. I think you can see in the Canada I think those mountains in the very back, I think that's in Canada Urge. It's fucking amazing. This, this thing in front of us right here, that island, it, that's actually an island, even with those big trees and the thing. The river splits in half and goes over by that road you see over there and then eventually kicks back by these neighbors' houses and comes back in. So right there where you see those brown houses on the thing, if you went out there on a boat, you could take a left-hand turn after the, after the island tip and half of the river runs on the other side of it. It's pretty fucking cool. I love the clouds and everything. It's fucking... It's, I don't know, 50 degrees. And I've never been more comfortable. I mean, I'm in slippers. I got one sock on, though, because I got some wicked blisters. But this is, this is my happy, happy, joy, joy uh, temperature. Okay, well, I just thought I'd make a video of me enjoying the river. And wishing my wifey was here with me, enjoying it. Well, we'll be here soon. <coughs> I'm going to go find a place to uh, to take a leak. <laughs> All right, Bert. I'll make another video soon. These are going to be lame without my damn selfie stick. You probably can see my fucking arm. All right. Later, Bert.